Justin Tucker set to boom this one away. And off we go from M&T Bank Stadium. And able to take it past the 25 and up to the 28-yard line. Dangerous Saquon Barkley. And able to get this one across the 45 before he's brought down. First play of the drive, a success, 19 yards. Good sign here early. Everybody on offense there up front in the backfield in sync on that play. So much talk about what do you do to neutralize home field advantage? Well, teams that run the football effectively, they often have a way of neutralizing it in a big way when they have those types of runs. And he'll go down, but not before getting this inside the 30. 24 yards the game there. Another first down as well. A lot of times the key is just get him the ball and let him do his thing. And they got it out to him on the left side. And he did exactly that. Excellent run after the catch. Throwing his hurts. A rifles run, and that's going to be intercepted. Picked off by Roquan Smith. And the Ravens are going to take over at their own 30-yard line. Not something you see very often from a quarterback of his caliber, an opening drive interception. Oh, there's no doubt in my mind that even he's surprised at how that one played out. But we know this guy is not going to stop him from continuing to fire as this game goes along. Probably give a little nod of respect across the field for that one and let him know he'll be back the very next series. So the completion good for seven there. And it'll be second down. To throw is Jackson. A check down here for Henry. They'll get three as the drive continues. It's a first down. Well, that was a pretty favorable situation there. What would you call that? Second and manageable? Smart play, too. Didn't force it downfield when he didn't have it. Just checked it down. Let him get the first down. And that's exactly what he did. Here's Jackson to throw. That's complete. Left side to Bateman. And he'll go out of bounds. It appears right at the 45. So give him five yards there on the pitch and catch. And that'll bring up second down. A short throw caught by Andrews. I think defensively you're okay with that. Here in the first quarter, he's going to get some catches, but they rallied to him quickly. And that's what you count on. And I like what you just said. First quarter... Can you do it all game long? They catch it, you tackle them, they go down on the spot. Because when you're able to do that and you don't give up big chunks of yardage after the catch, now you put the offense in a position where every series they have to work hard to pick up first downs and you tend to stall them out when you do that. Oh, a big decision here early. Look at this. They're going to go for it on their own side of the field. They're indeed going for it as they look to throw. And Jackson's so tough to stop. He's got a first down, and he gives himself up there at the end. In motion left, Flowers. Play action. It's Jackson. And he'll be hit as he releases it, and that'll fall incomplete. It sort of looks like they still have some fight in them on this series because it seemed like things were headed for the red zone. But this defense gets two more stops. They can keep them out of that area. Now a second and ten. On the ground, this is Derek Henry. A nice little juke. He'll be dropped at the 25 after a gain of six. He had to fight for every yard on that run. Shook himself free of a tackle and kept fighting, even with the rest of the defense closing in on him. That's the kind of effort you'll take every single time. Jackson. 
A little short one there, caught by Likely. Touchdown! Isaiah Likely, 25 yards for the touchdown. And the Ravens use the early turnover to get on the board first here in this one. On that third down call, the goal was to get the ball to their tight end and pick up a first down, but he wasn't satisfied with just that. They got the first down. That was the gravy. He decided to take in the whole meal and rumbled in for a touchdown. Tucker able to connect on the extra point, and that makes the score 7-0. Tucker now to kick it away following the touchdown. And a nice return sets him up pretty good here right at the 30-yard line. Already at the line, this Philly offense set to go. Now remember the last time out, they threw the interception. That led to the touchdown, so now time to regroup. It certainly is, and their goal right now as they go back out on the field, a calming drive, something that takes the ball, keeps it for a while, lets the defense relax a little bit, lets the offense regain confidence in their game plan. Play action. Here's Hurts. And that's caught inside the 30. And they're able to work this to the 25 before it's all said and done. That one good for 37 yards. You ask tight ends about their favorite routes to run, and surprisingly, this will pop up as one of their staples because they run so many routes in the middle of the field. How about this one? Starts downfield, bends it to the corner, Great touch on the football, and they turn that one into a big play. Hurts. Oh, this one incomplete. The pressure got to him as he released it. And it's second down. And a smart play there. He's probably saying, I wish I would have done that on the last drive instead of throwing the interception. Complete pass leads to second and ten from the 25. First carry for Kenneth Gainwell. Down to the 25. They do get a yard there, but only a yard. Leaves him with third and nine looming. After one, seven nothing on EA Sports. Start of the second quarter, and it's the Eagles in possession as they've got it with a third down coming up. They'll come to the line here needing nine yards to pick up the first. Hurts sets up to throw it. Complete. That was well defended. They clamped down on every available receiver. Just got to give the win to the defense on that snap. The Hurts not coming to the sideline. They're going to go for it. From the shotgun, he'll look to throw. He throws, and this is going to be incomplete. The Eagles unable to convert there on fourth, and the Ravens are going to get the football back. Well, I guess they wanted to get that touchdown right back on their first drive, but failed to do so. And what they have to be careful of is pushing so hard to stay right there, to stay even with their opponent, that they gas themselves out. You know, it's almost like horse racing. Sometimes you don't want to take your horse right to the front and let them do all the work and then someone catch them at the end and pass them up. You want to make sure you moderate what you're doing along the way and then go for the big finish. Good work after the catch. Gets him 15 and a first down. First down. First and 10 at the 40-yard line. Off the option, here's Henry. And he'll be brought down just shy of the 45. Give him five on the carry there, and it'll be second down. Off 
off the option. Here's Henry. And trying to push forward, but he is going to be stuffed up in the backfield. Chalk that up as a four-yard loss. And now it's third down. Throwing is Jackson. He's got his target. That's complete. And he will have a Ravens first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Now that was pretty. They executed that curl route versus zone coverage. And that changes things a little bit because against man, it's often a tight curl, a tight, sharply run route. Again, zone, you're just looking for that open spot, that dead area. So you may curl it a little bit wider just to get to that place. And usually a tight window. He fired a bullet in there for the completion. A first down carry for Henry. Despite this strong run, he'll be hit and dropped shy of the 45. From the 46, here's the second down and nine. Off the play fake, here's Jackson. This will go to Henry out wide. And he'll get this to the 30-yard line before crossing over out of bounds. The Raven passing game getting in sync, another first down. Play action. Now Jackson. He'll get this to Flowers. Left side. And in for the Ravens touchdown. Zay Flowers. 30 yards. And the Ravens go up by two touchdowns. And there they got him the ball. Just get it to him. Let him do the rest. You know, he probably said that to his quarterback as he broke the huddle. I like the play call. Just get it to me. I'll take care of the rest of it. Helping out his rack, right? R-A-C. Run after catch. And he loves that. And he's going to carry that in at contract time. Tucker with the extra point. And it's now 14 to nothing. Tucker now to kick it away following the touchdown. Now a crease here as he's past the 30. And they finally get to him out near midfield, but he's all the way across the 45 to the 46. The Eagles offense sent to begin their next drive. And they're in a bind early here, down 14-0. Are you worried at this stage or still too early? You're worried. You're just trying not to transmit it to the rest of your team. You want to make sure that they stay positive. But at the same time, you're wondering, how are we going to move the football? What do we have on this play sheet that can work? Get back to basics is usually your answer. And make sure you find the guy who can move the ball fastest for you if you just get it in his hands. Yeah, still second quarter. You get points on the board here. I think you're feeling okay. Open man. That's Devontae Smith. And he gets us to the other side of midfield across the 45 before going out. Hurts to his former Alabama teammate Smith for an eagle first down. They'll set up a throw. Towards the end zone for Brown. And it's intercepted at the goal line. Eddie Jackson picks it. And the Ravens are going to get the football here as the ball will come out to the 20. Well, they were going for the big strike right there, but this just terrific coverage by the defense in the end zone. And what helps being a safety in this spot is the back line of the end zone. Defensive back coaches always preach that's an extra defender because you know that they can only run so far. They can't run past you out of the back of the end zone. Then you know you can't be beat over the top. It gives you a chance to go make a play. Escaping the pressure right. That's caught. It's Flowers. And he'll have it past midfield almost to the 40 before being taken down. Now the Ravens going to use one of their timeouts. As he'll get a chance to talk it over after picking up the first down. Now it's Jackson. That pass is caught by Hardy. He'll get it inside the 20. And they'll have it in the red zone before he crosses over out of bounds. 
Another first down. There's 